Cheryl, if a company has a contract with an um, invoice for ten thousand dollars on a net thirty, but they need the cash flow, I'd buy the receivable for nine thousand nine hundred dollars and pocket one hundred once paid. Numbers are a bit better than that. Okay, uh, okay, now I know what you're talking about. Yeah, it's fine and dandy in good times, uh, Cheryl, and when the receivables are, you know, sometimes large companies they don't pay out for three months three or four months so you need to carry that debt for that long a period of time and what happens if all of a sudden there's a hiccup in the markets which there could be and this is one thing that happened with nortel networks in the late 1990s and 2000 when the tech bubble burst Nortel Networks was as a Canadian company is one of the top companies in the world tech companies in the world with the most amount of patents it was considered to be uh, the forerunner um, to be the biggest large tech company in the world right and they had a lot of receivables out to multiple companies and then the interest rates went through the roof all of those companies or not all of them many of them went bankrupt and all of those receivables became write-offs right so you have to make sure you're not overextended with that type of deal if you're taking on that um, buying you're basically buying debt right you're basically buying debt if i understand it correctly